This is the Lock Picking Lawyer, and the lock I have for you today is the Kryptonite Model 851196. This is a pretty big shrouded shackle padlock, a full 61 millimeters across. We have an 11 millimeter molybdenum alloy shackle, a six pin core with a bunch of security pins. So in short, this is a beefy and pretty competent overall padlock. I believe this is made by Schlegg. I'm not sure about that. It's no longer sold by Kryptonite, but it is still sold as a Draper Expert 61 millimeter in Europe. Doing the conversion for currency, this lock goes for roughly $110 to $150. So it's a pretty pricey padlock as well. In any case, we are gonna see how hard it is to pick into this guy. So let's get started. I'm gonna use top of the keyway tension with a 50 thousandths pry bar. And then let's get a standard hook, I think in 18 thousandths. Okay, let's see. One's loose, two's loose. Little click out of three, maybe. Four's binding, click out of him. Five's loose. Okay, six, got a little click out of six. Back to one, little click there. Click out of two. Three's binding. Click out of three. Nothing on four. Five's loose. Nothing on six. Click out of one. Click out of two. Nothing on three, four, five, or six. Okay, hit one again, went into a false set. Nothing on two, three, four, okay, five, getting some counter rotation. And we got her open. Okay, so not too tough a lock. Let's pick this or uh, take this guy apart and see what's inside. There is a screw down the shackle hole that lets us take this apart. Okay. Okay, before I move on to the core, let me show you this, this retainer plate in the bottom because it's a lot thicker than what you would normally see in a lock like this. I have one right here from an American 1100 and you can see much, much thinner, not only with the plate, but the security nut as well is much smaller than the one on the kryptonite. So they scaled up the, the retaining device on the bottom to match the beefiness of the lock. That's always good to see. Okay, let's get this clip off the bottom. Okay, got the clip off. Let's get our key and a follower and we should be able to get this apart. Okay. Dump our key pins out first. Okay, one is a steel serrated, two is a brass serrated, same on three, four, five, and six. Let's get these arranged. Okay, let's take a look at these drivers now. Number one is a steel anti-drill pin, standard. I think the rest should be spools. Yep, two is a spool. Three is a spool. Same on four. Five. And six. Okay. Let me give you a close-up of all of this. If we look at the pins, we can see that all of our key pins are serrated with number one being a steel anti-drill pin. Then for our driver pins, we have five spools in slots two through six, 
and a steel anti-drill pin in slot one. Moving over to the core, we see nothing special, which in and of itself is a bit of a disappointment. On similar locks to this, I have seen counter milling in the core and also extra hardened inserts for drill resistance. I don't see that here. I was hoping for it, but overall, even without those features, it's still a pretty competent lock. That's all I have for you on this Kryptonite Model 851196. If you have any questions or comments, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.